Hey, mama. I think I fucked up. What happened? So, aunt brought us these donuts yesterday. World famous. World famous Randy's, and they're actually very, very good. And I got so excited. I was like, hey, mom bear, let's split in half. What do you want? What do I want? And then she cut them all in half. And look. Nope, let me open it. Not a single donut in sight. The problem is, I told Taika, yes, that guy over there, <laughs> that when he finishes his breakfast, his healthy one with all the protein and stuff, that he gets to have a donut. And I didn't realize until after I finished it. So now... You deserve everything that's coming towards you to you. Why? You He's have done this back. to me so many back. times. You gotta have my back. Uh, there's times where we go, let's say McDonald's, and we buy hamburgers yeah. together. He's eating, 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 eating. And then I go to get my hamburger. He goes, oh, I ate your burger on accident. He's done it to me so many times and then I have no food. That's what he did to Taika. He told Taika, he's gonna save him a donut. Look. He ate everything. Oh my goodness. <laughs> me. You didn't say So don't worry. No, no, you, you didn't tell me you want one. So I ordered you didn't more. Even think about her? I ordered more. It's coming. Okay? You're so rude. I ordered more. I messed up. You didn't save one for your mom. You didn't save one for Taika. I. Always save some for your mom. I'm gonna apologize the way the Liver King did, okay? I own up to it. I completely messed up. And I'm gonna fix it. Horrible. Okay? If the Liver King can get away with it, so can I. Do you want to see that you can't? I'll, I'll blow <laughs> no, the no, lid no, off no, no, this no, 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 joint. No, 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 not with that I guy. Touch, I trust him, I said, he will improve. His heart is always good. He's yes, 38. Yes. How much time <laughs> does he need to improve? He's a big boy. <laughs> <laughs> I saw he's a boy too. He's 38. <laughs> so I really appreciate my daughter. Oh, I have to clean up the best. <laughs> yes, all nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're yeah. very nice, very nice. <laughs> we have all right, so what I got to do today is fix up the rest of the gym stuff, which is all this stuff right here. And it wouldn't have been that big of a deal until we saw these crazy clouds. What do you mean big of a deal? Big of a deal to do what? Because I would have had all morning. Yeah. And I could have took my sweet time to do all of it. But now I Why have to Why would you take your sweet time? Your sweet wife needs your help inside the sweet house to put all the other shit away. Like what? Like what? Like what? Literally all the boxes that are in the house. Okay. No, I wasn't going to take my sweet time. You just said you were, you son of a bitch, I caught your lazy ass. <laughs> no, no so I, I was going to take, no, I was going to take quality time, quality time, no, no, quality time. Like no, not in a rush. No, 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 no. You know me, I, I work hard. So I need, I was going to uh, take my sweet quality time, but now I can't because it's going to rain soon. But the whole time there's something, wait, what did you just <laughs> suck something in? You caught me in the dawn. <laughs> you just suck something in right now? Anyways. What I've been dying to do all morning since I woke up. Eat the fucking donuts and be a No, besides the donut, dad. besides the donut, yeah. is Bill Tyka's basketball court. So he can play out here wait, while wait. I'm working. Okay, so you told me you got a court, but I don't know what that really means. Is it like a Fisher Price type of thing? Because you didn't even show me. It box showed up and you were like. I'll show you a little bit, but it's like a, like a little, it's in between a Fisher Price and a real court. So it's metal hoop, all that stuff. Oh. Kind of like the one he has at basketball practice. How long is that going to take? Because you're making it sound like it's like an all-day process. Like, isn't it only like 15, 20 minutes to install? Yeah, but not. things are different when you're in a rush. Because now I'm trying to beat the rain. Dude, it's 9 o'clock. That's late already. You only have to put it inside and then just fucking organize it later. All right, can you help me put it inside? What are we talking about? Or do you want to... Oh, whoa, <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. You got to stay on your pants. What the... Get your life together. What the hell is these are that? My, these are my indoor uh, the house hell? cleaning sweats. The shit I'm going to do inside the house and not fucking take my sweet time on you fucking... Do you want to see his cutie corta? And when it's done, yeah, I want to okay. go inside. It's fucking cold right now. It's 43 degrees. Then hurry up. Help me start moving. I don't need to help you with shit. What are you going to help me with? Isn't it crazy that Vegas rains? No, I'm serious because like when I first moved here, I think I just I just thought Vegas was like never rains or whatever, but it actually rains quite a bit. It actually threw me off. I'm like, it rains like not as much as California, but yeah, California barely okay, even rains but too. Don't change the subject because I'm not gonna help you. Okay, then help me. Go. Okay, good night.
Mama? Yeah. I saved the day. What happened? Oh, is it here? <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Did you get assorted? Or the originals? Uh, originals, of course. Good, good. I was about to divorce you if you got the assorted. What? That's for the weirdo lunatics. Monkey! <laughs> Look what your papa did. <laughs> How dare you, how dare you, Monkey. how dare you son of a Your bitch. Your papa? How dare you son of a bitch. Look what he did. Look what he did. Monkey. Your papa did that. Can you finish all of them? Yeah. But look! Why would you do that to him? But look what he did! These were the old ones. Those, those were old and gross, and he didn't want to give you old and gross ones. So look what he did for you. Why? He loves you so much. Ooh, fresh ones. He got you fresh ones. So good. Did you finish your breakfast? Yeah. Let me see. Let's go inspect your plate. Let's see. Let's see if you have finished your breakfast. Oh, yeah, yeah. oh my. Hey, Papa, nice that's pretty good. Good job. You did. Papa the best? I know these names of the donuts. What is it? Blades. Blades. <laughs> this guy's a oh, connoisseur. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, you have a whole thing. Pa Papa, thank you so much for finishing my donuts and then giving me a whole box of <laughs> You son of a bitch. <laughs> tell him, tell him, thank you for finishing all the donuts and getting me new ones. Thank you for finishing all the donuts. No, no, he threw them in the trash. Yeah, I threw them in the trash because they're so old. Duh. His trash is this. <laughs> 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 you son of a bitch. Hey, that's a good one. You almost destroyed this kid's dreams today. You, oh my god, what the? That's a thumbnail right there. I'm taking all the water. Why are you taking all the water? You're a doctor? Yeah. I don't know you're a doctor. I'm taking her blood. Okay. What does the blood say? Is she healthy? No, I have to check and see if it's bad blood. Okay, is it good? I don't have bad blood. I have good blood. Oh, this is good blood? Okay, let me put it back where it was. <laughs> you put it back where it was? Yeah, why is he going to waste it? Well, I think that violates a lot of like medical codes. Did I put blood in it? It's my blood, huh, Yeah. I don't know if you could just take blood out and put it back where it was. I have to check your teeth, okay? I feel fine. I have to check your teeth. How check many people's other teeth did you check with that? 100. <laughs> <laughs> okay, there's a lot of customers. Yeah, look at the positives. Yeah, just don't stick it in my mouth. There's a lot of germs in there. Did you clean it? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <That's how you laughs> <check. laughs> Is that how you check? Hey, monkey. Do you want to help me build something? Yeah, toys. Do you know what Papa bought you? No. Hot Wheels. Or Mama and Papa bought you? Hot Wheels. In this big old box? Yeah, but like a Hot Wheels set. No, it's not a Hot Wheels set. I love Hot Wheels. I know you do. We'll get you more Hot Wheels. But you know what this is? What? It's a basketball court. Uh, <laughs> uh, basketball court? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Got NBA moves already. Do you want to help me build it outside? This looks like a relatively easy build. Got the base. Looks like the hoop and the nets in there. Little wheels backboard a pole looks pretty easy i found a little um i think it's like a maybe between five to seven foot court on amazon it was only a hundred bucks i figured he's gonna outgrow it really fast so i didn't want to like buy some crazy ass legit one because when i buy a legit one for ourselves um because we're gonna, probably gonna put a um a basketball court i think in that section where all that grass is the usually the adjustable ones go down to seven anyways so I'm like, I think probably in a year or two, he'll be at the seven feet. So I could just lower the legit one down. So I only need something that covers for like a year or two. And he's been crushing in that basketball practice. Can't wait to show you guys. So I just bought a quick little cheap one so he could dribble around. Cause I see him dribbling around at home and I think he has a passion for it. So we might have the next Jeremy Lin on our hands. You know what I'm saying? Oh, someone looks how, nice and warm. How did you got that even when I was sleeping? Yeah, I ordered it online. But how? I went on the website and I typed in youth courts Wait, and this I, came I, out. Is this a wheel? Yeah. Guess where those goes? You know where it goes? Could be. Maybe somewhere right there. Or maybe, no. I need the pole have, though. 
And then, and then we have to flip it. You know where I think it goes? What? I think it probably goes here. Oh, yeah. And then you stick the, the tube through the middle of the, the wheel, maybe. Mm. But we gotta look at the instructions. Hey! <laughs> hey, good job. I think it's like this. Could be. We gotta look at the instruction manual. Double and check. Then, and then, and then, and then we can have the flip. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what that's for? I'm pretty sure that's used to connect some piece. Okay. So it looks like this is the type of help I'm gonna get. It's entertainment help. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my goodness. <laughs> want, can I try? Yeah. Okay, um, come close, come close. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds funny, can't take it, yeah. So this is why it's helpful to have your own set of tools. Cause this is the like nuts and bolts kit it comes with. And these are the wrenches that it comes with. And, <laughs> and when you want to build something with the tools that it comes with, it's usually very difficult, right? Because it's not a socket wrench. Okay, 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 okay. But good thing I have my own tool set. So the first thing I find is I take one of these nuts and bolts and I find what fits it. So I got a socket wrench on this can I side. Keep this? You can have it. And then I found another wrench that fits it perfectly. See? So now we're in business and we can go fast. I'll probably build this thing, I think probably like under 30 Ten minutes hour. maybe like 15 minutes Wait, are you ready time to build or are you still playing the trumpet i know why we need those um rope is why what the rope is the net why yeah. do we need the net for this because uh, basketball courts only always has these nets that's true so, okay you ready to tighten it now do you got the right size? I believe so. So we got this right here on this side. And then we got this on this side. Oh yeah, there you go. Now we're in business. See that? <laughs> You're making me laugh. I'm making you laugh? Oh, this is going in forever. <laughs> there we go, look at that. Ooh, nice and tight. Now what do we do? The other side. Can you find another piece that looks just like this? Yep. Smart man. No, told me, man. Told me. Because we're going to see the same height. All right, can you tighten this for me? Yes, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Good job. Did this oh. one. Oh, 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 uh -oh. oh, it's crooked. That's why I started over. Don't take it off. Okay, put it back on. Okay. How about we just... So you can tighten it? There you go. Ooh, good job. Hey, you're a good helper, huh? Nice. Nice and tight. tight. Dad can climb up there. No, don't climb up. No, no, no. Please. Put it in the hole. There you go. No, it's not in the hole. If it's in the hole, it won't splash. <laughs> it's all over the place. In the hole, right in the middle. There you go. There you go. That's dead center. Good job. Oh, no. There, there we go. Yep. No, 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 you're gonna get all wet. It's gonna be cold. Okay, make sure it doesn't fall, okay? Okay, mister? Okay, here we go. Start tightening them. This is how we do it. This is where the tools come in handy. That. That's how tools come in handy. See that? Wow, one finger went off. See? Two fingers went off. See? Okay, good. Hold on tight. One finger went off. Oh no, there's only one finger, Papa. What? Look how much fingers went off. Oh no, <laughs> use the whole hand. Use the whole hand, please. Okay, here's another one. That's almost done. That was two screws. We're on the second one. There's only two fingers on there. No, the whole hand, please. That's why my things keep falling off. There's only four fingers. It's a test. Uh oh, you're gonna pass the test. You're gonna fail the test. Oh, there's that was the, that was a test. There's five. There's five hands. There's five fingers working. Okay. Don't You just give me a kiss. No. <laughs> Are you sure? I just spit at you. All right. You ready for the most important part? Yep. Here we go. Here we go. Oh no! no. <laughs> oh, what the? Have, there was sand. Did you see the sand that came out? Did you put sand in here? Me? Yeah, no? No, I never put sand in that basket. There was sand in there. 
Are you sure you didn't put sand in it? Yeah, I never put sand in it. Okay. It hasn't hurt before. Okay, here it goes. Oh, sand's drip. Oh, oh, wait, it's raining. It's also raining too. That's good. Okay. Dun, 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 dun. There we go. You're wet, Papa, because of the rain. She's here now. Look, Mama. You see the Kenny basketball court? Now can I shoot? Yeah, shoot. Go, go, go. Hey, that was pretty good. One more time. One more time, one more time. I know you got the skills. Ooh, pretty close. No! Go get it, go get it, go get it. Good job. Hey, what happened to all your basketball skills? I'm his bad luck charm. I know. And another donut? Are you serious? Okay, go. Go, monkey. Over the rim. There we go. What? Is the ball too big? Whoa, is this one just hard like that? Let me see. Let me see if Papa can do it. Hey, that's called cheating! <laughs> you go. Damn, this is a hard court. Hey, if you get good on this court, you're going to be in the NBA. This is a hard oh. court. There we go, in the NBA. All right, so one down, another one to go. Got to clean up all this mess and this is the stuff that takes a long time because it's a lot of like little intricate random things like these little bars and I just have to put them all away. So it's usually easy to put away big blocky things like putting away this punching bag, super easy. But the little stuff like that little handle right there. Well, it's dark in here. Yeah, like that little handle right there and sorting it, making sure the flow and the usage of everything is gonna be hard. One big thing I have to do that's gonna take up a lot of time is when they installed this rack, they didn't do a good job. So you see how it's flat? It's not supposed to be. It's supposed to be tilted at an incline so it's easier to put stuff away so you don't smash your fingers. So I have to take all these weights off, unbolt it, and then bolt the other one just one notch up so that'll be slanted. But you might not tell the difference here, but you'll see the difference when I'm done. Hopefully get everything organized. I am thinking I might even have to build a shelf in that corner because we don't we have like a bunch of gym, gym bags and I hate having gym bags on the floor like that. Like I hate having the gym be a mess. I like things clean, off the ground, super organized yeah. like this. No good. Probably mounted up here somewhere or something. But yeah, this is the the finagling part that takes a while. So I'll probably be in here for a few hours while this monkey dude got his energy wore Barbie? out. I'm your what? Are you my Barbie? Yes. Yeah, thank you. Are you my Barbie? No. No, I'm definitely Holy fuck. That was scary as fuck. I thought I was about to lose my thumb. No bullshit. Because I was trying to adjust the slope of the dumbbell rack, like I was telling you guys. See, that's how it's supposed to be. But the people that came and assemble, the, the assemblers, they didn't pay attention to the render I gave. Because I have a render of how everything's supposed to be set up. And I didn't think they just probably just put everything together the way that's the easiest. It's also my bad that I didn't double check. Because I was probably just so happy to see everything <coughs> put away. And I'm in the middle of unpacking the other stuff that I can't really inspect every single part that they didn't put it on but anyways um when i was taking that bolt out actually on on this side in order to push the bolt out i have to push it through this pole right see it's like three inches wide so i'm like feeding my thumb through it and then as soon as i fed the bolt through which it was originally stuck in place it decided it wanted to collapse so it comes down hard on my thumb and it was gonna it felt like it was gonna slice it off and my phone is out of reach so i'm like yelling i'm like babe 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 my mom finally comes out after like five minutes goes and grabs geo she comes lifts it up and thank god i was able to pull it out and i slapped the bolt in so now it's holding it on both sides now i can fix it but that's crazy i was like i can't believe i'm about to lose my finger to fucking gym equipment how ironic is that it's supposed to make me stronger yeah, but out now I'm, as I'm looking around, I'm like, man, I really should have double checked because there's a lot of random things that they do. So, for example, I didn't even notice, but there's a random bolt that they were just like, I don't know where to put that, so I put that there. 
and when a bolt is really tight looks like this see how i tightened it where that middle washer is completely even there's no space i just noticed that under here it's fucking loose as fuck over there watch i actually hand tightened it already but look at that you should not be able to do that with your hands if it's like torqued with enough pressure so i'm like dude how many of good thing i put this squat rack together so i feel really safe or me and mike did but i'm like how many other screws are not on that tight so i'm gonna literally tighten every single fucking thing so that it's safe which is why these little intricacy things take a long time because you're just like you open one thing, you find out the other thing's fucked. Like, dude, is that fucked too? Look, at, look how big that gap is. Holy shit. Dude. Well, at least not, can't move with your hand, but I can definitely tell there's a gap right there. See how it doesn't feed through the nut? Look at that. It should be fully penetrated, you know what I'm saying? Can you talk about your finger? Rolling. All right, so it's lunchtime. Making some food, making some cooking nasty udon. What's really ironic is that my favorite udon, although some of the best like beef udon out there is really, really good, my favorite quick and nasty, or well, actually just udon in general, is the um, post shabu shabu udon. When you boil all that stuff in there, and then you have ponzu in there, and just all kinds of stuff together. So when I make my quick and nasty udon, that is my actual goal. So I'm gonna put some of this udon that I already made quick flash because nice and it <laughs> falls out um quick flash because um i don't want i want it to be al dente is that enough for you yeah you sure yeah look at all that yeah okay so i do this right here like this i'm just <laughs> I'm freaking stuck at this well i wouldn't use that spoon what would you use tongs smart Mm, shaka laka laka laka. Ooh, look at that udanskis. Do you want any more udanskis? That's it. No. Okay. I ate like five donuts. True. Three slices of pizza. True. OJ. Alright, so I get this udon. So now, what this doubles as is both the protein and also the broth. So I already seasoned it with just a little bit of salt. That's all you need. And I just throw a bunch of meat in here. Why is it so little? Why'd you get the smallest pot we own? I just had two pots. So I just did it like that. Throw about half of this meat in here like this. Oh shit, that's actually very deceiving. I didn't think that much was gonna fit. See, that's why sometimes you just shut your mouth. You know what I'm talking about? Just shut your mouth real quick. You felt that you felt the fucking burgers go on, my, on your arm? Pop the boogers out, see? Put that in here like this, just a quick little flip of the wrist, you know what I'm saying? Because we don't want it to be too well done. Do you like it well done or how do you want it? Uh, Not well, but like definitely not raw the way you like it. Okay, so I'll keep that going. Now what I do is get some of the veggies that cooked up. Just some quick cauliflower, some garlic salt, some uh, popcorn butter seasoning. Why are you trying to act like you're like a culinary artist? I'm not. Is that enough? Yeah. For us? Okay. Yeah. Go like that. Save that for later. And then mix this around. Is that cooked enough for you or not? Why is one meat purple and the other ones aren't? Well, what do you mean cooked good. enough for you? That's all pink still. What's the difference? Medium rare. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You want medium rare or no? More than that. Okay. Well, I'll we'll let it cook a little bit. Yeah, please. All right, but this is how easy this is. You see me make the udon. Made the cauliflower on the side. Throw some meat on here. How much meat you want? Tell me when to stop. That's good. Okay. Now. It might be too much actually, but whatever. I'm trying to mimic the shabu shabu experience. Yeah. Our favorite sauce, ponzu, <laughs> right? Put like that. Yeah. All over, all up, all up on there. Yep. And then. And then. And then what I do now is get a little bit of the pasta water. You know what I'm saying? Oh, you know what I'm saying, play, play. Yep. Just a little bit. A little bit of pasta water. Okay. Like that. And then a little bit of beef broth. You know what I'm saying? Why the pasta water, not all beef, beef broth? Because then it's too rich. 
Oh. I'm trying to mimic the Shaboin boys. All right. The Shabizi Beezies. Okay, now that you have this. Now get out of my face. Let's have you try it. Because I've actually never made this before. And then hopefully. Then you it's try good. it. Hopefully it's good. You try it. I just made it from my brain. And I think in my brain, it tastes really good. So I want you to sip on the broth. That's good. It's good, huh? Yeah. It's good, good. There's some good stuff. Yeah, get some of that beef broth, a little bit of pasta water, that ponzu, quick and nasty. Does it taste at the, like the end of a shabu? That's my favorite part. Mm-hmm. That's good. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Ooh! Five minute udon with papa. Did you just jizzack me? No. Nope. You just straight jizzack me. So I just finished the garage, except for the mats. Still gotta cut those so I can go in there. But everything is nice and organized now. Put up those posts to organize all the grips for all the cable machines. Got the punching bag set up. Even brought up my gloves. Might even start doing cardio here now. Found a better place for the foam roller in that corner. It used to be over here. Threw away the other yucky bench, but not the good bench. But got a lot of stuff done here. The part that wowed me the most is that it's actually freaking snowing. Like, watch. Look at that. Do you see that on my sweater? It's actually snowing. Like, little bits and pieces of solid snow would land on me. Right there. You see that white one? It lands and then it melts almost in like 30 seconds. But it is indeed snowing, which is freaking cool. I've never lived in a city that snowed before. Snow? Yeah, like live in a city. Obviously, I've traveled, but like live where that's like my home, my primary residence. I've never lived somewhere that snowed before. I've always wanted to. It makes it feel extra Christmassy. And this is so awesome. I just yelled for Taika to come out. Hey, check it out. It's snowing. It's snowing. And then he was like, ah, it's cold. So we went back inside. But this is freaking rad, man. So rad. Put your shit go that way. All right, you can see the snow. Whoa, way crazy here. I didn't see that mountain range. So this morning, all we saw was that mountain range, and then there's a whole side one, and that whole, whole top end. Wow. That is crazy bones. Look at all of that. Dang. Becca, let me see your socks. What? Barbara Brigade. Hey, where'd you get those socks from? You bikini? You big cutie. Put these on, put this on. Oh yeah, because it's Which cold out there. It's comfy cold. 41. It's going to be 34 tonight. Woohoo. Then we're going to come up 